Behind the camera is Bill, and together we are Felisa. Welcome back to another awesome day, another awesome vlog. We are here at Disneyland today. We are in Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. We are right here at the marketplace, but we're getting ready to take you on an adventure over to the new ride, Star Wars Rise of the Resistance, that's gonna be opening in Florida at Walt Disney World on December 5th, 2019. And right here in Disneyland, on January 17th, 2020. That date is right around the corner with the holidays. It's gonna be here before you know it, so you need to plan your trip because this ride is gonna be an epic battle between the light side and the dark side, and you don't even have to have any lightsaber training. Let's go. I'm gonna be helping out Ray because I have to make sure, she's heard that Kylo Ren is down here and she's gotta make sure that he hasn't taken in any of our people into custody. And then she wants me to head back over to the Rise of the Resistance ride and hang out there. If there's any trouble, she's gonna to come to my aid right away and bring Chewie to help. We're right outside the ride, Rise of the Resistance, and you can purchase any type of resistance gear that you want. There are all types of things to choose from. If I wear boots though. Yeah, and that one is what's going to be the fast pass entrance for the Rise of the Resistance ride. I'm telling you, this ride is going to be so incredible. I have just learned so much information about it. And one of the things that I've learned that I've been so curious about, in the very beginning, you're actually going to travel under AT-ATs. And yes, they are called AT-ATs. There has been a lot of controversy as to whether they are called AT-ATs. I have done my research, however, and any time there has been any toy or any kind of commercial regarding Star Wars or any kind of interview that is regarding the AT-ATs, that's exactly how it is stated by official people. So you can do your research and you can find out this exact information as well if you want to be sure we're pronouncing it correctly so that you know how to say it yourself. But back 
to the At-Ats, when they were building Star Wars land, we could see from a distance these big, incredible At-Ats being built. And then they disappeared into a building. Since we've been in Star Wars land, we have never seen them. Now we know where they are. They are inside the Rise of the Resistance, and I can't wait to see them up close and in person. Anyways, back to the ride though. There are going to be so many different layers to this ride. You are going to be in a battle. You're going to be chased by Kylo Ren, and you are going to have to help the light side win against the dark side. You're going to have to be strong, but you also need to know there are going to be some amazing intricacies into this ride. For starters, they have taken some of the information that they used when building the Tower of Terror, which is now Guardians of the Galaxy, and there is going to be an incredible drop in this ride. It is going to be so wonderful. You're gonna love it, but make sure you hold on to your seat because that's not all. There is going to be so many cinematic projections. It is going to be like you are actually there fighting and you are going to love it. It's going to be so interactive. It's going to be what they are calling the best Star Wars ride ever. I am so excited for this ride to open and I can't wait to go on it and show you every detail. This ride starts at a Rebel Outpost and then you will be pulled into the Star Destroyer. Everyone's gonna round a corner and there are going to be, oh my gosh, it is going to be so incredible because there are going to be so many stormtroopers, you're not even gonna know what to do and that is where the fight begins. From there you're gonna enter a trackless vehicle which is an amazing new technology that I cannot wait to see. You're gonna be led by a droid as you fight against the dark side. It is going to become so intense, but don't worry. We have infiltrated this area as well, and everyone from the light side is going to be there to help you in your journey. They're gonna show up when you least expect it to make sure that we win the battle. We being the light side against the dark side, but not before you take an amazing plunge, which will feel like an elevator drop. At this point, the battle is almost over. This is going to be a 15 minute experience and you are not going to want to miss it. So you need to make sure to plan your trip now. Make sure to schedule some time aside to be in Star Wars land for quite some time because you want to make sure January 17th, 2020, you are ready to be here and ride the new ride, Rise of the Resistance. Right behind me is actually the wraparound of the regular line. You can see how long it's potentially going to be, and I believe it probably will be, as it wraps around and heads back into the tunnel. And I'm hearing some really incredible sounds coming out of there. Everybody, we've just stepped out of Star Wars land to the Hungry Bear restaurant because if I don't feed my Chewbacca, he's gonna get hangry and we don't want that to happen. So we're gonna end our video here. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed all of the updates and the news on the new ride that is coming to Star Wars land. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye!